Hey, I'm Jordan. And I'm also Jordan. This, this is, is Jordan, Jordan Squared. Squared. Please wait. For what? The disc to load, obviously. Disc. But we're on the PS5. Yes. That I have multiple discs. For... No, it's fine. <laughs> I mean, I still have my original of this game. Chapter 4. Moon and Fate. Wait, you want me Moon you game? I, I mean, I didn't know we were that close yet. Look at Maru with that, her strut. Her hater's gonna hate strut. It's pretty good, yeah. Ah, and there's the moon. The majestic moon. Moon. God damn it, moon. moon. <laughs> Ooh, a desert. I could go for some dessert. Welcome. Ah, I'm totally beaten. We came all this way. We cannot go back. If somehow we just walked from the tundra down to the desert. Yes, we will. No need to return. City of Wingley's, Rose said, is just over there. What is it called? Ulara? I hope we can find what we are what we should do there. I hope so, too. I'm here, too. Everyone, get inside me. Thank that includes you. you, Black Monster. Uh, uh... Wait, go back to where you're standing. And look to the right. I mean, to the left. To the left. No, no. Stand. Oh, there's... A stand. Oh, there's a st but yeah, like... Sorry, what am I standing at? Uh, stand around there. Uh-huh. Stand to the left to look. The way your hand is undulating there, and how it kind of looks like it's that your crotch is not does not sit well with me. It, it, really? It, yes. That's just gonna stare at you for a second here. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Enough with the undulating cod piece. That's what it really looked like at the one angle. Is that it looked like a cod piece of undulation. You're a cod piece. Of undulation? Sure. I don't know why, I just really like the word undulation. It is a fun word. The undulating undulator. Alright, welcome to the death frontier. For all the encounters are static and- oh shit. <laughs> Alright, I forgot it was that soon. Alright. <laughs> I'm okay. Thank God the ground was not hard. Speak for yourself. Where is that? Oh God, my my lungs, they hurt so much. I think all the air was knocked out of them. Who could imagine there was such a place under the ground of the desert? It must be a cavity created when the water dried up. I thought cavities were made by candy. No, it's the cavity creeps with their big rules. Ah. Without a knowing, until the end! I wonder if this little world has experienced an end like that. It is not determined yet that our world will end. That's true! We still have the power of youth! Oh god. <laughs> Yeah, huh. we're back here. So the nice thing is you can basically avoid encounters here if you want to not get into a fight. Oh, neat. So everything's on the map. We still haven't actually seen what Albert's full attack is. Uh, whoops. His full um Edition. Yeah, the flower storm. I switched into a shell and combo so I could keep uh, uh -oh. leveling stuff up. Yeah. Fruit. Oh, that's a very small Australian mosquito. Summon four gods. Cambria Dayfly. <laughs> 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 
You didn't laugh at my joke. I don't think you understood my joke. Mosquitoes from Australia or something? Yeah, that's a very s small Australian mosquito. <laughs> yeah, at least it's not an Australian spider. Oh god. Those things terrify me. Whoa! Ah! See, that's what happens when you distract me like that. Like, we just get mobbed by sandworms. And now, you that's know, fine. It's, it's just Dune all over again. I don't, I don't know Dune. I've never read nor seen it. Yes. But I do know that the sequel to, to Dune is Spice World, speaking to Spice Girls. That, that's not correct. That's, that's the extent of my knowledge of Dune, is that people were making jokes that Spice World is the sequel. Well, Dune is the world that Spice comes from. Alright. Is it the same kind of spice that that uh, Han Solo smuggles? No. Oh. Although that may have been an inspiration when we talked about Kessel. And spice mines. Of Kessel? The Kessel run? That you can do under, what was it, 12 parsecs? Yeah, it was. Even though a parsec is... Why breaking stuff? Even though a parsec is a unit of... Of distance, not time. Yeah, yeah, and then they try to explain it in the solo movie. It's just like, haha, see, it was navigational, not actually. Well, it's not even. Not, it wasn't even the movie, because even before the movie was a thing, before Disney bought the franchise in the expanded universe, which is now Legends, there he did. It was explained that the Kessel Run was. Like, something about, like, flinging between black holes or something. And, like, doing it under 12 parsecs was, like, the most, like, means that you were able to perfect, perfectly navigate through all those gravity wells of black holes. So, it wasn't the movie. It was already established. Right. Yeah. Also, I've never read those comics or read those books or anything. I'm just basing this off of reading on Wikipedia many years ago. So if I get anything wrong, don't jump down my throat. I'm admitting that my source is faulty. But what if your source was salty? Then I ate fries. Also, are you lost in this desert? Uh, no, I'm not. Water! It's refreshing. Smurf just shoves her face in. <laughs> I mean, I would too, if I was that thirsty. Yeah. You're no monster. We, we can rest now. What will the Wingleys in Yolara know? Fuck all. They should know the we, or at least I, should take. There's no need for you to come. Do you know Dewey? Are you still saying that? <laughs> <laughs> that was perfect timing. Don't you understand it's no longer a problem for you alone? You just found it out a couple of days ago and now you think you can judge me? Yes. It's not as easy as pursuing one wing. <laughs> oh. Bitch, please! <laughs> <laughs> you say it was easy? Don't be so conceited. Stop it! You both are youthful. It won't lead us anywhere. Rose, nobody could understand the weight of fate you have carried, but we at least lighten the burden for you. Albert, can you can you calm down? Just no. You're, you're at a, you're at an eleven. We need you at about a six, okay? You can suck my dick. <laughs> <laughs> if you have the strength to argue, we can go on. <laughs> My comment of, you could like, just, I love that. I'm, yes, I know I'm laughing at my own joke. There is no other way, is there? Pointedly does not answer that question. <clears throat> but yeah, I don't care that I'm laughing at my own joke. My joke was funny. You're funny. Thank you. Looking. Thank you. So is Lloyd dead? I wonder. Oh yeah, we got we need Albert. Right. 
Yeah, put Einstein back in. You also need to uh, increase Miranda's additions. She doesn't have any. Oh, right. This counts as a heal. Oh, neat. Okay, let's see if I can remember where to find it. Um, between... God, I'm just remembering that one episode of Dilbert when he's in the bath and he drops the soap. It's like, I can't find it. It's too small. It's like, you made me think of Dilbert and sex at the same time. You ruined everything. <laughs> Why are you not fighting anyone? You're cock teasing oh, me. Power down. Beer roar roar roar. Alright, let's fight a bunch. <laughs> So, I have the speed up, the power up, and the power down now. So, when you use these, the power up and power down at the same time, you can do some pretty ridiculous damage. Those are items? I'm trying to remember what they are. Yeah, they're reusable items. Oh. Oh. oh, oh, oh. oh. Yeah, basically one halves the enemy's uh, attack and defense, one can... Double the attack and defense of your party member. That's like so. Effectively, you would be doing four times damage. That's like using Hastiga and Sloga against the enemies. Well, you haste yourself. It's like, oh my god. It's like I'm going super fucking fast. You can't do anything. This is why, like. Is it Titus? No, no, I can't remember. Is it Titus or Titus? What is the correct pronunciation? Uh, I honestly didn't tell you. The correct answer is Titus. Isn't that what you get when you cut yourself on something rusty? I don't remember the next part of the quote. No, that's rabies. Bit. Yes. Gosh. God, I love when they eat shit. It is pretty funny. And there's poison, that's what I didn't want. Yeah, I guess he's fine. Inferno! Inferno! Got him. There it goes. Yeah, you did it! I can get rid of Elmer. Yep, fuck off. <laughs> You're not wanted here anymore. Because Shell's got so much more grinding to do. <laughs> grinding. <laughs> Shell. <laughs> come again. I say come again, and then I'd laugh because I said come. Thank goodness that's not the case. I remember the first time I saw that joke in Family Guy. I was too young to know what come was. And I'm like, oh... Okay, is the, is the joke that, that he's just an idiot that will laugh at anything? I didn't actually realize it was... A like... thing, yes. Uh, I think that's it. Yep, that's him. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we'll fight a cop. Because you've seen the dayflies, you've seen the sandworms, you've seen the scorpions. I didn't know that was an enemy. I legit just thought it was a cactus in the ground. Well, it is. It's just a man eating cactus. It just happens to be a man eating cactus. No, it's just a cactus, see? <laughs> that wind up is pretty dumb, though. <laughs> hmm. Yes! Go! Yes! Uh, it did. It is the cactus in? No, he did. The cactus. I already would say you did. Yeah. I don't know why. I just love saying that. Like love hearing that. I I what say you he did. That, those sandworms could take a lot. They're tanky. Oh, what? Okay, so. What is a better tank? Having high defense or having high HP? You can only have one or the other. What's more important for a tank? Depends on how high the HP is. Okay. Because here's one thing you forgot. 
My numbers are a bit worse. Bigger than yours. <laughs> I'd laugh because I said numbers. Oh my god. Numbers are funny. But the universe is pretty funny. What is the funniest number? Do you have a definitive answer in mind for that question? I just want you to give an answer and I will give you my response to your answer. I believe that the funniest number... Now, what is the loneliest number? Uh, I would say the funniest number is... I was hoping you'd say 69, and I was going to... Oh, there we go. Blazing Dynamo. Ooh. So I was hoping you'd say 69, and then I'd be like, nope, 69 is actually a 6 and a 9, not a number. It's just two numbers in sequence. And be like, checkmate, biatch. But no, you had to ruin it by actually giving a single-digit number. I need that time to friggin' switch my issues on that, because I was trying to get to the chest. <laughs> By the way, the correct answer is 69. Yes, I am mature. Of course. The show is that, 609. Nice? Question mark? <laughs> you know what's better than 69? 96. It's just the butts touching each other. That That's butt stuff, right? On the butts. Gladius. Okay. <laughs> oh yeah, I think that's Rose. Um, Flameberg instantly kills enemy with given probability. I don't know what that probability is, but it's increasing our damage, so there you go. Oh, I hope it doesn't, it's not one of those things where, I know in some games, yeah, let, I want to take a look. My god. Yeah, I know. Already, see, basically, an on, yeah, Crush Dance... Doesn't do as much damage as Moonstrike, but it gives 100 SP while still doing as much damage as Volcano. Mm -hmm. um, but Blazing Dynamo is, at its first level, as good as Crush Dance maxed out. My god. Yeah, aren't these looking dope? My dick. Alright, go back to Hachelle. Yeah, he's got, a, he's got a ways to go. Yeah, I, I also still haven't seen Five Ring Shattering or Hex Hammer. And it also slightly bothers me that Summon Four Gods isn't four addition, like, isn't four attacks, and... Well, it is four attacks. It's adding three. Oh, uh, okay. My frustration is gone. Also, you can keep it on summon four gods to keep yeah, that up. Yeah, 20 more like, of those. Yeah. We'll just skip it. Okay, so I went the wrong way at some point. This is not... Uh, well, I want to... I'll see Blazing Diamond, though, eventually, because... Yeah, I'll run into something or I'll fuck up. Well, because... You will always have dart in your party. Until I don't. Oh god, what if the Wait, no. what if dart's the final boss and you play a Zeke? That'd be amusing. I ain't saying nothing. Uh, no, not this way. Okay, I think it's up one and then to the right. Nope, can't go to the right. That's a whirlpool on top. Eh <laughs> heh, top. <laughs> oh, right, because this is the one that's literally in the arrow pointing. So someone wanted to ask me there we go. sub or dom, and I, it was a weird question because why am I comparing Subway with Domino's? Yeah, one makes sandwiches, one makes pizza. It's, yeah. it's completely different. Yeah. <laughs> I also, oh my god, it was so funny. There was a, I remember seeing on, on Twitter, uh, a sub shop asking asking how you top your sub and then, and then a couple banned, banned all of you are banned yeah you people are not okay <laughs> <laughs> i love that so much like it's pretty ridiculous but just imagine being like like I wonder if that was, if that actually happened, or if that was just a bit, you know? Right. So where are you actually trying to head right now? We are trying to get to Yular, the village of Wings. 
Okay. So I. That was the desert. I meant not the desert. The forest village that Meru is from, right? So that was a Winley settlement. Okay. But turns out there's another one. Oh. Don't right worry, I believe oh, in right, you. Alright, I'm back, uh, back here. I am reminded of Agrabah, Cave of... Treasure? Cave of Wonder? It's Cave of Wonder, whoa. Yeah, in Kingdom Hearts, the first one, how, like, there's a top and a bottom, and they are interconnected, but it's also just a fucking maze, and I'm like, oh my god, where am I going? You're going to Schwantown. And then it turns out you can swim up waterfalls, but nothing tells me that. I'm like, what the fuck? When could I do this? Okay, here's the... The hell was that noise? That was the flies. God, if I was in the desert and I just started hearing a fly making that noise, I would just lie down and accept my fate. It's well, like your fate is sealed. Yeah. Okay, so I think down left and to get around this waterfall. Because it was a wall to the right. And then I went. <laughs> oh it's it's like a grid based. Yeah, it's like D and D. Except not really. And worms everywhere. Oh, did I put it upside down? Okay, well, there's no worm. There's no, um, no quicksand here. Quick sand. Also, I don't. Is it this one? Also, I'm surprised at how, like, I thought okay. I would have to deal with quicksand a lot more in my life than the zero times I've had to deal with. You it. know what? So many people our age had that exact thing. Like, we would see quicksand in media, or we'd watch that one Bill Nye, yeah. uh, where he talked about it. All right. We made it out of the death. And also, I thought people would offer me drugs a lot more than the zero times it has happened. So, one time while I was attending- At band camp? I put a flute in my- anyway. Oh god. Um, <laughs> So, it was this instance of um, being approached as I was walking towards the college campus uh, and asked, not if I wanted to buy some drugs, but if I knew where to buy some drugs. And the guy approaching me said, oh, and I said, I'm sorry, I don't actually know. And he's like, oh, okay. You look like an intellectual stoner, so I thought maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I remember once someone on the street asked for asked if I had beer and I'm like no how about weed no heroin that's a no. that's a jump yeah I'm like for the record this was also before weed was legalized so so it's like okay so I don't have the perfectly legal uh, substance I also don't have the illegal substance that's socially acceptable why do you think I'd all, I would then have the just straight up illegal shit? Yeah. You need to damage that guy. I was trying to get into a regular fight so I could show you uh, Blazing Dynamo. But you get my just like, what? Yeah, pretty much. There we go. Except for an actual regular encounter and not one of the stupid jar things. Another Jar Jar. Uh, sure. So what's the deal with these? I don't remember, because like, some of them, they basically have very specific conditions. Thanks. <laughs> Just comes up in batches, calling them, it's like, meh. So are they kind of like cactuars? They, they drop special stuff. I don't think they give any experience or money. Oh. But uh, finally, we're in the chapter where I can show you the Rainbow Bird that I've been saving those sachets for. Rainbow Bird? Yeah, it's 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 an enemy of that type. The only way it can normally be damaged is to. Um, is that what you're uh, showing me now? No, um, that's later. But uh. the only way you can normally damage a rainbow bird is to confuse it and have it itself. Huh? Wait. What are you doing now then? Blazing dynamo. 
Oh, I just assumed we because Dart's always in your party, you'll eventually see it through just well, yeah, natural but, progress. Well, yes, but that's a that's a big ball of shit. Yep. What is that thing called? It's not dung beetle. It's a spiky beetle. It's a dung beetle. Also, oh. that that worm is having the time of his life. Hey, <laughs> yay! Nice. First try. I like how he kind of squats at the end. It's like, ha! I done the attack. Now I'm gonna take a shit right here. In the sink. I mean. Where cats go. It is instinctual for to bury the waste, yeah. Yes! Touch! Go! Smack, 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 smack. Bug jump. Good. 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 No bad. Oh. Why bad? Yeah, because I fucked up the last hit. Oh. Heschel. Or maybe... Bash. Bash him dead. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Bye. Whee! Wow. Alright, and next time on Jordan Squared, we'll go to the spring breath town of Yulara. Ooh.